Jewelry, and I'll see you Monday night at midnight. Bye, everybody. I love the Tucson Gym event because you just never know what you're gonna find. It's the greatest treasure hunt on earth. Every time I find a gem here, it's the most spectacular moment. There's so many people here from all over the world. I love the Tucson Gem Show. I am just so honored to be able to share some of Mother Nature with so many people. It all starts right here. The vibe here is almost electric. This is better than a tray of chocolate. Hey, you never know what you're gonna see at the Tucson Gem Show. It's what us jewelry lovers wait for. It's every time we go to the Tucson Gem event, the world's biggest jewelry and gem and mineral show, uh, we wait to see what our favorite designers bring back. And of course, we've got our world famous rock hound, our gem hunter, J. King, back to bring us all these wonderful new mine finds. We've got great prices on other items and very limited uh, treasures uh, that you know how it is. If you see it, you love it, can't be made in, you know, in mass because they, they are very rare mine finds. So if you love jewelry, this is a handcrafted collection, all hand finished. J. King's been with us. It's going to be 25 years in 25 October. 25 years in October. We love you. Isn't that funny? We never get sick of you. That's a good thing, right? <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> so let's adorn you with some beautiful jewel jewelry. My name is Leslie. We'll kick off this show with a quick five items, very limited in five minutes. It's a five and five. So always very rare, very coveted, almost impossible to source. Jay, you've done it again, but look at the price we're doing on your favorite Red Sea bamboo coral. $45 for this beautiful chunky strand. You know, we're gonna have, so the five and five, the hardest thing for me is to talk about anything for a minute. You know that, right? <laughs> <laughs> so so here, here's the thing, and I'm, uh, I, will, I can say universally, and then I don't have to say another thing for the next five and fives. As the manufacturer, there's none of these at the prices they're selling them for. You couldn't literally, as the manufacturer, you, I can't build it mm -hmm. and be able to sell it for that price. You, it would be un, you would just be unable to do it. So all of these are screaming deals, uh, and that's what they all have in common. And here's um, the thing. Just unbelievable price. Only 150 of these. Jay, you always talk yeah, about how rare it is because it's general, It's a protected right. mineral well, or gem, it, The right? thing is, is, too, is these aren't um, here because they didn't sell well. If you read the customer reviews, it's um, it's that we don't have very many left. Final quantity, 672409 is your red bamboo coral, 18 inches in the length. Peak this one. This is the most beautiful treasure. And Jay, we're traveling to, I think it's five different countries actually, on this three strip. There's design. actually six countries, six really? different materials. Ooh, so um, tell me. Yeah, you, so you go to Madagascar, Brazil, Zambia, Namibia, China, in Malaysia, mm. and so you've got rose, uh, you've got rose quartz, green adventuring, uh, amethyst, tiger's eye, yellow argonite, Ooh. and uh, plume agate, which is the purple, kind of like the purple material. Not pretty. That's that's actually plume agate. And you get this luscious three-strand design that just fills in the neckline. We'll welcome our beautiful Valerie modeling these pieces today. But over seventy dollars off our HSN price. Final two hundred. They are so bright, natural color, and beautiful. They look like. Well, if you look at this, we used to call this uh, effect treasure necklaces because literally, if you think about them, they're treasures from all over the world. Oh, uh, and especially in this. It's a great look. And here again, uh, crazy, crazy value. So at 672417, we're moving on to this beautiful ring. And right until the start of the show, I was looking at this gym, trying to find a ring, trying to find a loop saying, Jay, how did you do this curved turquoise on this beautiful dimensional ring appraised at $250? Look at the price we have on this today, sizes 5 through 12. You know, this is insane. And also for the people that are out there, and I know, um, you know, I've, I've, I've had the privilege of meeting several of my viewers. 
And um, a lot of them are collectors, which is really cool, and they collect the turquoise. Th what makes this so viable is the designs, you know, a gallery design, crazy price. Here again, couldn't build it. But to be honest with you, this is Cloudy Mountain. I had an exclusive on this turquoise mine. Um, this is, uh, we're kind of like the last of the last. This doesn't, the mine um, just basically, we ran out of material. Mm. So this is kind of uh, some of the last of the last of the designs you'll be able to get. I love how big and bold and it, dimensional it is. Very contemporary. Is. Yeah. Well, okay, what would you normally pay for this in a gallery? I mean, that's literally a crazy, crazy price. Now sizes six through 11 left, 672-619 is your item number. Moving on to the rainbow of tourmaline, hundred over $100 off on this beautiful strand, 18 inches in the length, two and three quarter inch extender on that. No two could ever be alike, right, Jay? Right, Jay? Well, you know, what's really crazy about this is, so okay, pretty. and this is rainbow tourmaline. This is all natural. This comes out of Madagascar. This material, um, to be honest with you, I mean, this material is not cheap, okay? This is very, very expensive material. This is natural tourmaline. There's no enhancement to this whatsoever. Uh, the colors are the colors. Um, this is actually facet grade material. I could have faceted. I just wanted something a little bit more simple. We don't have a lot of these. And here, uh, you know, like the, the price on this, the price wouldn't even co uh, cover the cost of the, ma the rough material and the sterling silver finding, um, much less the labor or anything else. It, it just wouldn't cover it. Mm, if you love gemstones and you know that tourmaline is one of the most colorful you can buy, here you've got the rainbow. We took it from 175 to 72. That's 672, 646. And then we move on to this beautiful, all, all those neutral earth tones that we really love that are warm and juicy and, and luscious. It's the Autumn Chalcedony Opal Beaded Necklace. Where's this from? Okay, this comes from Ethiopia. And wow, it's, uh, it's actually, it, what it is is it's Chalcedony is the matrix. And then you've got, um, you've got like the, the opal seams growing through, uh, mm -hmm. through the material. Uh, this is really unique, very different, very unusual uh, rough material. I don't even have any more of this material per se in stock. I, I might have enough. I might be able to do a ring or a pair of earrings or something right. like that. But um, this this actually was brand new mind find that we released. Beautiful material, and again, uh, and it, just a ridiculous, ridiculous value. You may have noticed that all of our jewelry as we celebrate the Tucson Gem event is on Six Flex. Six seven two three nine zero is your item number. Only eleven dollars and sixty nine cents on a credit card. If you want a necklace that matches with everything, that's the one. Six seven two three nine zero is your item number. Moving on to something brand new. This is what we wait for. We look to see what Jay found and brought us new. And if you're a purple lover, if you're an opal lover, oh, or even a February baby, you're gonna love this beautiful piece. So it's the Violet Opal and Amethyst Collection. We've got a beautiful necklace and pendant. They come together, so you do get both pieces there today. And then we also have these beautiful little drop earrings. But Jay, it looks like brush strokes on this. I mean, what cool material is this? You know, in um, you know, so the theme of the show is mind finds, right? So it's mind finds, and that's what we do. Okay, this is what I live for. And I've been doing this for 40 plus years. Um, the show in October will be 25 years, just the show here. But I've been doing it since I, I'm, um, I'll be 64 this year, and I started my business officially uh, when I was 20. So uh, we base our business uh, now. Uh, our cornerstones in our business, of course, are turquoise. But my second uh, cornerstone that I have, every trip that I start um, at any given time through the year, it either starts two ways. I'm going to a brand new turquoise mine, <laughs> or I'm going to a turquoise um, mine to buy that I've already that I already do business with, and um, and I'm you know re-upping on materials, uh, or I go to a new opal deposit or a no opal mine or go to an existing opal mine to do the same. Those are two, two uh, cornerstones of our business and everything else that I do splinters off of this. This is a brand new violet opal. This is a brand new mine find. It's a brand new release. Here's a piece of the rough. Ooh, if you want to show that. the rough. Um, I, I'm doing these specimens now. So I'm uh, taking the rough and I'm just grinding it down. You can see, but the character of this isn't this wild? And it, it, you can see it's like white, and then it yeah. has purple seams that go through it. So very, very light violet uh, opal. I don't know of anybody else 
that has this material. Uh, as far as I know, we're, we, we have an exclusive on it right now. I don't know anybody else that has the material. There's not a lot of this. It's not like they have the violet opal mine. Um, this comes out of Africa. Um, it's, it's a very, very uh, small deposit. Mm -hmm. I've, you know, I've gone back and I've uh, accidented it with uh, amethyst. And I did that because I thought the, the violet, the light purple, That's and then the pretty. dark, and the dark uh, Zambian amethyst, they just really pair together very nicely. It's a nice soft color power, it very is. relaxing. And what I love with this too, and again, you know, we do this with almost all of our necklaces. Uh, so you can wear the pendant separately of the necklace. Mm -hmm. So you can just wear the necklace. It's a standalone on its own. Or if you want to wear the pendant, you could, especially if you have one of our silver collars, yes. beautiful like that, where then you can layer them both uh, even together. even on a longer ribbon or a leather cord, right? Well, you, you know, you could do, so there's also a lot of people, you know, yep. even if you've got, um, maybe, you know, like you've got herringbone chains or something like that, oh, I mean, yeah, there's yeah. different things you can do. Um, maybe if you even have, like, if you think about it, if you have a lapis strand, if you have turquoise, there's so many things. This is a kind of a neutral material. Yeah. So we'll go back to almost any of the mine finds that we have. It's a great layering piece uh, we try to make everything very utilitarian but if, if you're one of those people that you like to have things that everybody else mm -hmm. isn't wearing or right. everybody else doesn't have this is kind of if you collect mine finds this is something that you might want to consider uh, again it's a brand new opal this is its world launch um, now that being said there isn't some huge violet opal mine, right? I mean, if you saw this operation, this, this is literally pick and shovel. I think the most high-tech thing that, that, that they have is like a wheelbarrow, okay? And I, that, that really is about as high-tech as it got. It's a labor of love. Yeah, and th they literally, we got, I think we got eight barrels of this. And so I got, uh, each barrel has right around 500 pounds. So, I mean, oh and you gosh, think that that's that. a lot of material. But just to make that necklace, the, just the necklace, you burn three to four pounds of material. I believe it. And by the way, I know the, 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 our, our, our screen says the pendant. No, you get that necklace as well. Right. 18 Nexus inches in the length, two and three quarter inch extender on that. And you're also getting that pendant that's almost three inches long. This necklace and pendant was appraised and we take the lowest price we get back at $335. If you're loving the earrings, and I think we've got fewer the, of the earrings now, uh, they come in just under under three inches, and it's this beautiful little multicolor violet opal and, and, and amethyst bead drop earring. Very easy, very simple, but if you love purple, you know it's a regal color, you know that it's a tranquil, a serene color, it's a rich color. There's a reason so many of us are drawn to it. You've got to have this collection. It looks like, I say like those impressionist paintings, right. those works of art, looks like little dabs of, of paint. Like if it was hand painted, it really is such interesting material. When you look at this, and you know, that's what actually drew, uh, drew me to it when I first saw it, is I've never seen anything like it. The, the closest thing that I, could, that I could compare this to would be the Jalisco uh, lavender opal that we did, and that's all but gone. So this is a, it, it's a brand new mine find. And you know what, what I love about what we do and what I really, really gets my creative ju juices going and flowing and I get excited about is bringing things to you that nobody, you've never seen before. Mm -hmm. And to tell you the truth, um, the biggest challenge I have with um, all of the, the miners I work with is getting to understand that I'm interested in things that normally you wouldn't even think of, right? Yeah. I mean, you, yeah. you know, I'm trying to get them to go out and actually mine different things instead of like just tourmaline or just sapphire, you know, actually getting to go out in the field because they pass on that. things like look. this. Do you look at it? It looks See? like somebody actually took a paintbrush. Yeah, like a and, landscape, and it, right? And you know, it's kind of getting a little bit washed out here in the stage lighting, guys. But if you can see this, this is a really nice soft purple. It's like a beautiful. violet color. It really, really has a, a, just an amazing texture to it. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Sterling silver, all hand done. Mirror finish, you literally could shave. Not that you would want it. I would shave it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you wouldn't necessarily Some of us have need whiskers. to. Let's put it this way: if you have an emergency, you can use it as a mirror, as a signaling mirror. Absolutely. And, and by the way, remember, it is this beautiful collection. I know that you've made us fall in love and start collecting opals. He's got a way about him, this man. Uh, if you want the earrings, less than 250 left. Uh, we also have the necklace and pendant available, and that is very limited. But if you're looking for brand new from Jay, 
Here it is, you guys, and we've got a lot of new coming up in our next hour as well. This is 080444. Violet is such a beautiful color, and because it's that soft, you know, muted look with almost the rich like purple. Almost like a neutral that you it can. It becomes a neutral. Yeah, that yeah. you can wear almost with anything. That's what Absolutely. I love. Absolutely. And what I love with this too is, you know, like you have a conversation piece, right? And, and I, I think that that's what's really cool. I get a charge out of it. I, you know, I have people come up to me all the time and say, oh my gosh, what is that? What are you wearing? You uh -huh. know, what, you know, what do you, you know, what, it, I don't, I don't recognize that yeah. material. And it's kind of fun to be able to tell a story and also let them know that, you know, you're one of the few people that has it, that yeah. nobody else has it. That's what I, makes it so you, fun You can't too. walk, I, I guarantee this, you can't walk into any jewelry store of in course. the U.S. and find this. Yeah. Give me Violet Opal from South Africa. Never gonna happen. Oh, sell out already. <laughs> Thank you uh, for that red sea bamboo coral. I think you're gonna love those big chunky beads too, not little itty bitties. All right, so we are, are we moving on to the next item? Sure, okay, so let's move on to the matching ring. And as I said, you know, maybe the necklace and pendant is not for you. I, for years, collected just rings. Maybe you're a ring girl. This could be your new signature. I love this very contemporary design. Look at the huge stone that you're getting there, okay? So that bezel set white and purple opal there we have sizes 5 through 12 it is a big chunkier band and even on that sterling silver band jade didn't just give us you know a plain old band i mean even artistry and workmanship on that too jade and these what are these are all on. individually handcrafted so they're they're made from sheet material pretty by hand so what's really great with these is even though they're big and bold they, they're very comfortable to wear. You can actually put your fingers together. You'll, you'll even forget that you have this on. Now, that being said, um, because you see how, the, how wide this shank is That's on right. this? You see how big that is as far as width? Mm -hmm. Even though they're made true to size, in something like this, when you've got that really wide shank, you might want to consider going up a I size. Agree. It'll be Just a lot more comfortable to wear it. Even though it's made true to size, if you wear like a true six, we make this a true six, but you probably need to go to a seven uh, because of the width of the band. Mm, we have 300 of these to go around and, and that's, you know, I thought of those, you know, those French impressionist paintings and the water lilies and how there was just these magical little strokes of paint. Look at that gem. Isn't, that what, and that's Isn't it all cool? Natural. And it's so soft It's and soft and it's like a violet purple it's color. Pretty. It's very, 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 it's, it's kind of getting a little washed out there where mm. it, lo it looks a little bit more uh, lighter than it really is. It's more, it's, it's a very kind of a vivid uh, light lilac. I love that we're giving tips right on the side of the screen on how to care for this, Jay, because you, you always want to be careful, especially with these rare finds that nobody else has. Just a little bit of soap and water would do, right? Little yeah, you, you know, like to even clean the stone, we, we include a polishing cloth. I always recommend, what I recommend is just a dry, dry nice polishing cloth, something similar to... Um, what you can, what we uh, provide with every one of our mind finds. Mm -hmm. So this one is appraised at 135. I love how we appraise it. We try our best. Some of these finds are so rare. I'm, honestly, I think 135 is is really modest. Uh, we've got it at 79.98 today. All jewelry as we celebrate Tucson Gem Event uh, is on six flex. So today, $13.33 gets at home. And I think too, if you collect opals or maybe you're an October baby, you gotta add this violet opal to your collection. It is breathy and soft and muted and no two will be alike. That's all natural color. I love that you do that, right? It's the natural beauty of a gem. You're like the only person I know that looks at rocks and's like, that's beautiful. Actually, my son, Liam. <laughs> he look, he's like, Mom, look at this rock. Isn't it cool? <laughs> uh, so if you want it, um, gonna, it's 695. I'll start bringing them specimens Aww, if he likes that. You're yeah. sweet. 695-934 is your item number. Quick little look ahead, you guys, because I know this is what you're waiting for. Look at what we've got for you. Hubei. I just have to say the word, Jay, and the phone lines light up, and look at how well, big these are. And just so everybody knows, okay, these are the last of the, the last of the designs we're doing. I, you know, I, I said this yesterday because we had a Hubei necklace on. I don't want everybody to get the impression that you're going to see Hubei every show. Mm -hmm. This is kind of like the... This is like the right. rainbow calcilica deal, guys. I mean, that people I've, are still asking I've, No, no, well, I've, well, it didn't make you, you could ask until whatever. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I literally have the material, but I, I guess what I'm trying to say, I'm in the throws right now. We have taken all four cutting shops and I'm in the process of gathering all of the last and the last of the Hubei material mm -hmm. and we're putting them in the last final designs. Mm -hmm. And I have to actually um, 
really kind of think about what I'm doing and how I'm going to design. This is uh, this was the oh, ultimate so design beautiful. for this portion of the material. Mm. And here again, there's not huge quantities of this. This is all natural Hubei. For people who don't know what that is, they call it vintage or antique turquoise. Uh, this material was mined in the when late I was 70s, born. early 80s. <laughs> that, yeah. that material is over 40 years old. And wait till you see it's collector's turquoise. If you're a J girl or gentleman, you are on that necklace right now. Uh, we're gonna give you a full presentation. If you wanna start ordering now, cause when it goes, it goes. 695-875 is your item number. We're gonna dive into the March babies, right? I'm a March baby. Um, take a look at what we've got coming up for you today. Cause when you think aquamarine, you know it's that tranquility. It's that serene stone that reminds us of the bluest ocean waters. Take a look at what Jay has done to get this size of the beads on the necklace and even the earring and to stay true to that color we're in love with, that is a feat in and of itself. So we've got earrings for you, great little giant bezel set button earring. We also have that graduated strand where even the color remains consistent even on the itty bitty beads there. 080240 is your item number. This is some amazing, magnificent aquamarine, right? Because normally it's very washed out. Okay, well, the reason it's washed out is for um, because of how expensive it is, right? So they're using the lower grade materials. I'm blessed in the fact that I found this. Actually, on a trip to Mongolia, okay, I was actually going to a turquoise mine when, um, when I found this. And I found this about five years ago, I guess. Um, is, is when I initially was introduced to it. We've worked with them ever since. This is mined out of a, a very, very small village. Um, I'm just guessing, but, oh I, gosh, but I think it's about 20 to 25 miles up to where the deposit is that they have on this. And the, there's literally, they walk up the mountain. If you think about this, okay, how they, how they mine this, um, and how fortunate, that's why I feel fortunate that we get the material. I don't know anybody else that has the material. I'm not saying I have an exclusive on the material, but uh, the way we work with them, wow. they, they actually walk up. Um, this is, um, uh, the, oh the mountain gosh. range is where, what, what they do is, th it's in China, uh, but if you, okay, so where they're mining it, this is actually, oh, uh, you can see the path up to the mine. Where they, where they mine this, if you go over the mountain, you're in Pakistan. Is, really? So it's right on the border. The people are very, that, that's actually the rock face that's going up to the mine. I don't know if they have a, a shot. You can actually see where they're, where oh they're gosh, actually Jay. harvesting. Okay, Look right there. That. Do you see that? See that, that's how the step. Now you see the shaft in the background yeah, yeah. up there? So what they do is they go in there, they go up and camp and they'll be up there three or four days. They mine and then what they do is they, they, uh, they do all of the, they, they take and they, they uh, 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 take all of the uh, host rock off of it, the matrix off of it. They do what they call cobbing. So they cob it all. So when they bring it down, like think about this. If you're gonna walk material down the hill back Gosh, to your village, goodness. are you gonna walk the best material or are you gonna walk marginal material? Mm -hmm. And so I think that that's why we only get the top, top grade material. They really, really are hand selected just because they're, that they literally have to walk this back yeah. on their backs. They're like, this they don't be have worth any it. horses. There's yeah. no mules. There's no no any even any animals. And then they take it down in the village. Um, then uh, they have this thing. It's it's not really a truck. Mm -hmm. It's I don't know how to describe. It. It's like a tuk tuk mm -hmm. type thing with with like this little bed. And they load that. They take it down to the train station. They put it on a train. Uh, and the train takes it oh to gosh. the port, and then uh, we get it from the port. And that is the exact color that we dream about. That's what aquamarine if you look should at this, look, look at, like. Okay. You see? And here's the thing is you've got that nice, that's all natural. That is nice aqua. It, it looks yeah. like puddles of water. Absolutely. Nice, soft blue. You know, before this, before I had this development, you know, the only time you ever saw aquamarine from me was material that I was getting out of Brazil. Mm. And they were always the chips. And we would do like waterfall necklaces, or maybe I would do- um, Like three strand uh, designs. Lapis, yeah, do lapis in aqua. Um, this material and what was so important is it allowed me to start cutting cabochons and, to, and start cutting structured beads. 
But the whole thing here is the color of this, the softness, mm -hmm. that beautiful aqua color. How it's um, unmistakably blue. You just, know, it's not like, is that white? Is that what? It is blue. It's what aquamarine should look like. And you said it. It looks like it's it's got water inside, right? It's, it looks liquid, wet. Yeah, well, the aqua, you know, is, you know, Latin for, for water, mm -hmm. right? So aquamarine. See, and this is a true aquamarine. You, you know, go out and price aqua and see what they get for it. It's just crazy. And like I said, as so far, I don't have any competition on this rough. Mm. I don't know of anybody else that's getting it. I'm not saying I have an exclusive. I don't have a deal where them where I'll take it all. I try to watch out for that because then you gotta take good, bad, and ugly. And I only take the good. <laughs> I don't take the bad and I sure don't take the ugly. So uh, we only take the, we, we do what we call select material right. or mind select. And look at the earrings. Even on and the that, earrings, uh, you get that thing, pop of well, blue. You know what I like though? You know, I designed this. Um, I didn't want to go over the top. I just wanted something really simple, something that you can dress down. I mean, yeah. you're, if you're wearing blue jeans, yeah. it's going to look great. But to tell you the truth, if you've got something really that you really need to go to little and dress up and dress, stuff, absolutely. You're, yeah, you're wearing aquamarine. Genuine, so you're wearing a natural color. Yeah. yeah. And it, there's a quiet beauty, that tranquil serenity of aquamarine, which is why I think we're all mesmerized by it. Look, um, if you if you can swing it, remember that the earrings are $10 on flex. Uh, the necklace is $20 on flex. You could actually get this sweet home for $30 on any debit or credit card and pay over time. But if you've been looking for those specific gems that you want to collect, this this is one of them. You don't have to be a March baby to see the beauty in this. You know, blue is that color of our favorite thing. It's a beautiful clear blue sky, those beautiful Caribbean waters, aquamarine at its best. And look at how beautiful this is. Remember, all handcrafted, hand done, all sterling silver, nice and easy hook. I love your hooks. I never fumble or well, you know need nice help these putting two? these on. If for people that haven't um, purchased, we put this, this is a finding we came up with. I don't know anybody else is doing this, this is two and three quarter inches extended, right. but it allows you to graduate this in quarter inch segments. So it gives you the ability, uh, I think it's very flexible, mm. depending on what outfit you're trying to yep. accessorize with. So you can, maybe if you wanna wear it a little bit higher, you wanna wear it a little bit lower. And also, you know, everybody's neck size is different, right? Absolutely. Um, I mean, we're, uh, we're not, none of us are, are built identically the same. So it gives you that flexibility even um, uh, for your neck size and, and how you want to wear it. So we are in a little bit of a hold, everybody. We're being reminded to tell you guys, hey, if you can, if you can swing it, go to hsn.com, shop there. It's the fastest way to get your very rare, unique mind finds. And when you're looking for the very best quality of gemstones, handcrafted designs, if you've gone to any of those little boutiques of your favorite cities and towns ac across the country and you find something like this, there are a fortune. So we're very lucky to be able to have Jay do all the hard work I, you for know, us, I Jay. didn't know you were a March baby, though. <laughs> yeah, but March we, 4th. March 4th, friends. Okay, my uh, my son's March 10th. There you go. And my Another wife's Pisces. My, March 13th. There you go. So I knew why we, why, <laughs> we you know, jive. yeah, we, we connected. Oh, <laughs> okay. um, I love aquamarine. I think most people love blue. Look at the size of those button earrings, by the way. Isn't that nice? And it's very contemporary. Yeah, you didn't give simple. us a little bitty. Right, they're not little bitty. And you know, in Val, you know, and I think this is so important because you know, like Val's wearing her hair down. She's mm -hmm. got it back and she's wearing it down. But you know, the, the biggest challenge with earrings is you can have the greatest, you know, you can have four carat diamond studs, yep. but if you Make can't see them, right. nobody knows. You're right. right? And uh, these, you know, they, they have a nice presence. Agreed. Uh, so we are moving on to the choice I made today. And I, let me tell you, I grabbed it because I saw it online yesterday and I was like, that's cool. It's like animal <laughs> print on a gemstone. That is its natural color. This is green zebra stone and I am obsessed if you love green gemstones, this is its natural color. And you see that beautiful pattern. Uh, it is like the zebra, right? Animal print, even on the beads. Now, this is the necklace. You get the pendant as well. So necklace, 18 inches. Pendant is almost three inches in size on that pear-shaped design. We also have that matching pear-shaped earring as well, uh, which I popped on too. But it is unmistakably that zebra print that we are obsessed with, all natural color. I mean, that is Mother Nature's perfection right there. You know, I haven't done this, but if you look at this and you look at the material, this, this is my specimen for my new bowl. This is my new deal, right? Um, oh, they're so pretty. So it, they make great specimens. That's all natural, right? But I want, you, I want you to pay close attention here. Do you see like on the earrings? Okay, mm -hmm. now I, the reason I'm showing you the specimen 
Do you realize that when the artists, the lapidaries, cut the cabochons for those earrings, they actually butterfly those. So they take the oh. material, they butterfly it. So, so that, it mirrors. So that it's gonna get as close as you can with natural material. That's but so th cool. That, I think that you need to pay attention to like the small details that we do to, you know, like they could have just willy-nilly just cut it like bread and put it in there, oh, but they really yeah. put a lot of thought into it. Do you see how the striations are? Look at on that. This? And it so actually, pretty. it's got the zebra, the color, it's like an emerald green. And then um, the stripes in this, but they have like a mica in it. So it actually glows and sheens. You got like a, a it's got like a, uh, it's almost like a, it's like not a, exactly like chatoyant, a pearl but it has right? that chatoyancy to it. It has that same effect where like, it's almost like a tiger's eye effect where you'll actually have it, you'll see that it glows and it, and it, uh, and you it know, sparkles. And look how nice it is. Even if you decide that you don't want to wear the pendant one day, how you still get the beauty and character of those zebra stripes, even on every single one of these beads. Isn't that pretty? And then if you love green as well. So I thought it was black and white. I read zebra stone when I walked <laughs> in and I saw it was green and white. Oh, that's the first one I grabbed. Well, you know what's really wild? Very limited, 100 to, of each. You know, like you look at these pictures, and you look at the pictures and you go, well, okay, take it or leave it. Mm -hmm. But I think that, you know, just there's the natural beauty. And just so everybody knows, and I get this comment all the time, it looked good on air, but when I took it out of the box, mm -hmm. it looked even better. I know. This is magnificent. Remember, 18 inches in the length two and three quarter inch extender, perfect example. We had put it on one of the later links and it was way too long. And I said, just bring it up as short as you can. I love that you give us that versatility. Don't forget that you get the mat, you have to go ahead and place your order for the matching earrings because this is one that is so rare. You're gonna wanna get those too. And because everything's on six flex pay means your earrings are gonna be 29, sorry, your necklace is gonna be $29 on a flex. Earrings, $16, making it really easy to actually own that sweet. 080-445 is your item number. This is brand new as we celebrate some of the coolest gems and minerals in the world for the Tucson Gem Event. We can take a quick little moment. I've got to change out. I still have so many cool things I want to show you. Everything's on Six Flex. Treat yourself to a little treasure today. We'll be back with more Jay. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smart and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. Okay, so I'm not gonna be shy about it. I like to eat. I'm a real foodie. And I'm telling you, we've got some tasty foods and they've all been curated just for you. Grab a seat and join us. Good eating with me every Monday at 5 p.m. I love FlexPay. FlexPay is a way to pay off your purchase in small increments. I get to make monthly payments on it, but I have the item at home with me. That's probably my number one reason for shopping at HSN. To break it up and have a monthly payment that's usually so low, it gives you lots of opportunities to really make purchases that you might not be able to make otherwise. It just makes it accessible for everyone. Much better than throwing it on a credit card at a brick and mortar store. We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search Gemstone to see our Gemstone Enhancement Chart. Here we are, checking out some of the biggest trends of Tucson this year. One of them is rainbow jewelry. It is back with a blast. Also, critter jewelry, wonderful cluster designs, all about layers. Stack your bracelets, stack your necklaces. Check out these initial bracelets. Those are also really fun, so you can customize and personalize your gift. Oh, and don't forget about blue. It's the Pantone color of the year.
Ajay. Uh, when you think that the Tucson Gem event, I think it was like 1955, right, that it started, or and you've been going for like the past 40 okay, well, years? Here's, okay, here's what I can tell you about it. Okay, so I, I've been attending it professionally for 43 years. I attended it two years prior to that um, when I, just as a rock collector, because um, I went to New Mexico State University. So uh, it was a short distance. We all used to all go over there. And it, um, it's grown from, back then it was just rock hounds right. and people that collect specimens. And now it literally takes over Tucson and as far out as 50 miles outside oh from the city. Oh my gosh, right? That's I know. And so I love that you do all the hard work in the walking forest, Jay. We really appreciate you bringing I, back. But look, I don't know if I do this... all the hard work. <laughs> you know, in fact, I tell all the people that work with me, all, all of them, all of my, my staff or family, you know, family members that, that work with me, that most of them have been with me for over two decades. Aww. I mean, you know, most people have been with it me for like 20, some people have been with me for 30 years, think about that. And I always tell them, if I actually had an employee that was like me, I would fire them. <laughs> <laughs> he says that. No, I'm really serious. I am the weakest link, you know. I, I am, you know, like I, I just, I take off. They, you know, they, my nickname used to be Where's Waldo, you know, because you never know. I call <laughs> them, they have no idea where I'm at. Really, where are you? But this is something you would not okay. find. You know what? I, would okay. you, you, you uh, no, find no, this, right? Not. No, I, I have to tell you this. Vintage. Okay, so now think about this. I want you to think about this, okay? I just came from the world's largest gem and mineral wow, show. Gee. The world's <gasps> largest. There is nothing that even is in the same, not even on the same planet, right? as big as the Tucson Gem and Mineral Show. This is like the Super Bowl for rock hounds. Mm. And I wanna let you know that there wasn't a single piece of this rough, right? right. I, didn't, I didn't see anybody that even had any finished goods. That's how rare this is. Oh, this yes. was mined in the 60s and 70s. Right. Or, I'm sorry, in the late 70s, early 80s is when this was mined. Is that, that's why they call it vintage turquoise, Well, it's vintage right? or they call it antique. Okay. Now, you, that being said, you, then you're probably saying, well, I've seen it with you, now you've got it. Don't, you know, I don't want, the problem when you have a material, all of a sudden people think, oh my gosh, you know, that's just readily available, you know, mm. and you're gonna be able to do it. I just want everybody to understand this. If you've shopped with me for any length of time, do you remember things like rainbow cow silica? Remember yes, when I said, yes. okay guys, you're not gonna have any more rainbow and, um, and then it's gone. And I can't tell you, that's, it's been gone now for three years. I still have people call me yes, up that think absolutely. that I've got some hidden somewhere, you know, mm -hmm. and I, I tell them no. But if you want, this is probably, if not one of the most highly collectible turquoises in the world, right. it's in definitely in the top five uh, highly collectible materials. Of course. The only reason I have this is two years ago in December, we oh, did this wow. as a today special, right? right? Mm -hmm. And how I did that is one of the businesses that I have is a partnership and there's a group of us and we're a turquoise buying kind of consortium, right? That we all put together turquoise. We own a lot of turquoise. I have a lot of turquoise just privately, but also together we, you know, I can't, I, you know, that we have the funds, the money to buy, right? And one of those members uh, is a member of the original family that owned this mine. Right, so he's a member of the Chu family, and his uncle is one of the uncles that wow, was the geez. original miners. Is actually the one that had this material. Now you're seeing the last of the last of the material. Look at the yeah. uniqueness. You know what? Anybody um, who's who's actually skilled or schooled in turquoise and actually is a collector, any kind of collector. You don't even have to be a serious collector. One of the things that that I love about this, this turquoise material is this is, it, it, there's, there is no doubt that it's Hubei, right? right? This is, you can, you can have sleeping, the nicest Sleeping Beauty turquoise, there's some of the turquoises I'm getting now, mm -hmm. um, like the royal blue, a lot of that, that if you, don't, if you don't really know where it came from, if you don't have a skilled eye, I know what to look for, but you know, you, you, that could be Sleeping Beauty or that could be uh, Campitos Blue Ice, it could be royal blue, if you, if you understand what I'm saying. When you see Hubei, that's Hubei. Mm -hmm. uh, these specimens that you that uh, that I always bring in. in I love okay. these. They are. So look at this. Check out these specimens, guys. And this is okay. So this look is at what this makes one. it. This is like my favorite. Ch check out this okay. one. Okay. So if you look at these, I don't know if we can zoom in. Oh you, my gosh. Okay. <gasps> see these different specimens. Yeah. Okay. Do you know these specimens are from the 70s? Could you believe? I've had these since the 70s. 
I kept these. These were my original specimens that I had when I was selling Hubei turquoise. Wow, Jay. When, when it was when I was buying it uh, in the early in the late seventies and the early eighties. This. this is what you know what I had. And and um, and I kept this, and I kept it in my collection. That's how much it meant to me then. But do you see how unique it. and different this material is? Absolutely. I mean, there's nothing else that mirrors that. Not Kingman, not anything. There's nothing that mirrors this turquoise and what it looks like. I know, and that's and, what you're getting. And by the way, if you if we hold this next to, to the this, specimen, you see, you see you all see the different how colors. You get to enjoy all of that magn. I mean, it is extraordinary. Turquoise. Do you see? Like, look at look at you can. And that's why wow. I bring this specimens so you can see you can actually identify this is a real deal now this is the first oh, time okay. i have done this design i went with the big chunk the wheels on this yeah, and then what i did here. is i put the round beads or the roundel beads in inside I and those that. act as pivot points so when you have this on it makes it very wear friendly it just feels very very soft around the neckline yes um, has it, a great it almost look. like it rolls on your skin right, right? nothing catches and and what's what everybody needs to understand, you won't see this through the end of the year. It won't. I'm doing the last of the last of the material that I have. Um, you know, uh, we've got another one uh, coming up, um, Leslie and I do, that we're going to introduce that's uh, the Hubei spider web, mm -hmm. which, uh, okay, now there's a couple hundred, okay? That's a, and, Oh, yeah, that's and, coming up later. Right, right. And that is the material. <sighs> All this material, I, I actually, when I got the main load, we sorted out... Um, uh, the certain materials yeah. that are like over the top, high end. Yeah. But I literally, to be honest with you, I could sell this rough material for way more than what we're selling the finished oh, goods for. Oh, 100%. But um, that kind of defeats the purpose of mine finds, right? Yeah. We always, we, we want to be the person that can bring things to you that you can't get from other mm -hmm. people. And this is one of those things. But please, don't, if you, and, and here again, I'm not saying... If you, if you can't afford it or if it doesn't appeal to you, of course, don't get it. But I'm saying if, if, if you're a, a collector and you like things that are unique and different, mm -hmm. that are going to be things that you could hand down, that, that something that you're not going to see from anybody else, that mm. really is something truly collectible. A rare mind I would say mm -hmm. that you really, if you, could, if you could afford it, you might really consider getting these while you can. Mm -hmm. it, it won't, they won't last. I already know. You know, I've already written almost all of next year. Mm -hmm. I'm, already, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm a Absolutely. good chunk into already because we have to work that far out. So I've already, I've already worked through, you know, almost to the end of the year now. And um, I know what I've got coming up and I will tell you, I've got to have a few Hubei items, but then that's it. And then yeah. it's gone. There's no, that's you it. cannot make designs right, because with material that you don't because have. Because anything that you f would find would be private collectors, right? I mean, there's right. no way to get it. It doesn't, right? I don't there's even know of any private collectors. The people that I know that have a private collections are people like me that right. have things that they're not going to- That gonna, saved it, right? They're not going to turn it loose, right? Right, right. I, it's just like me. I have Sleeping oh, Beauty. Oh, my gosh. I have, still Look have Sleeping gross. Beauty turquoise, but you know what it's reserved for? It's reserved for family, friends. I make gifts. Yeah. I just made somebody a beautiful Sleeping Beauty necklace, oh. um, and I give it away as a gift. I'm, I'm making things in, from my Sleeping Beauty for me now. Yeah. Um, but um, and that, but you're not going to have anything of any volume when no. anybody can actually do so it. So Jay, already 300 ordered. Our girls collect turquoise. I know well, turquoise is your first love, and to be able to have this here, I it, mean, this is a treat. It, it truly is, as far as materials. My oh. wife is my first love. Oh, that's true. Good, I, good gonna, answer. No, I'm going to say that because you. Just watch. <laughs> if she was in he England, he means it. He's uh, always if, talking if, about you. If she, if, she, if, she was in, if she was in England right now, then turquoise would be my first love. Oh, right, right, right. Got it. Got it. <laughs> you gotta have priorities. Point taken. But as far as materials, <laughs> turquoise is my first love. But I because everything you find, it's on the quest to find turquoise, well, not, right? Every, you know, either turquoise or opal. Right. But turquoise, I gotta tell you. Okay, and, and you're talking to somebody here. I literally travel the world, guys. If you don't believe me, come check out my passport. It's a joke. I, just, I mean, it's, it's a joke. Did you pilot your own plane for crying well, out loud? I don't, I don't know, know if you have the nerve I, to okay, do that. Okay, that being said, just so everybody knows, I do have, like, when I go to different countries, like Africa or whatever, I've got my pilot's license, and we rent planes there. I, can't, I don't have the kind of plane that I can fly all around the globe. Well, of okay. course, of course. But I can fly North America, South America in my aircraft, and I do. Um, I prefer to fly myself uh, when, whenever possible. Um, but it, uh, it is another tool that, that you can use. You know, a lot of these places, especially if you go to Australia, if you go to Africa, if you go to a lot of these places um, that I go to, it's not only safer to fly, but also you would spend months 
going from point A to point sure. B if you didn't. Look at the amount of vintage turquoise, okay, too. Feel, you didn't feel, even okay. give us the little itty bitty. No, no, I mean, feel, look at the and nuggets. That's, that's the thing. If you feel this, yeah. if you feel, this feels just like silk. Absolutely. When you put it on, it's very flexible. And that was another thing. You know, when I originally designed this, what I did is I did the kind of like the big fat tire roundels when right. I initially did it. And um, what I didn't like is it didn't flex the way I wanted it to <clears throat> because it's also, it's not... It's not just the material, it's not the design, it's actually making the design and, wear friendly. And, and even so the spacers, when, even on the smaller ones. When I want to do the discs, mm -hmm. I did the discs and I did the spacers, and I tell you, it's I did it because it makes it more functional. It's a very different look, but it's very functional. I really have never made this particular exact design before. So it, it really was a little bit of you know give and take and playing with it. it. And you know, the first time we cut it, we didn't have the flexibility. We really had to, I think when we first did it, we did a round. And then we felt the spacing was too drastic, so then we went with the rondel. Yeah, if you're a J collector worth your weight in salt, you will consider this one because, you know, $28 to get it home. You never know which one's gonna pick you because at the end of the day, no two could ever be alike. But it is that character of Hubei, how it's so distinct and unusual. And then, of course, the fact that there's just no way to possibly continue this and continue to bring them. It's very exciting. I can't wait to get it home. Um, I, if you want it, it is on sale. We've taken $30 off. This was appraised modestly at almost $300, Jay. What a treat for our customer as we celebrate the biggest jewelry week of the year, Tucson Gem Event. 695-875 is your item number. As you can imagine, we are very busy on the line. If you want to get fastest way to bump yourself to the front, of course, hsn.com or download our free app uh, already. Did you say, Kevin, over 400 now spoken for? And you know, the, the key thing with yeah. these is this is something that you can't replace. Think of all the turquoises. You know, yeah. I, I'm, I've got what I call my studio. I call it my man cave. My, well, my wife calls it my man cave. I call it my studio. So you're in there. Do you know what I'm doing now is I'm, I'm categorizing all the different specimens. And I have a whole series of turquoise. I literally have hundreds of different kinds of turquoise that I'm doing these specimens of. Do you know as I'm doing this and I'm cataloging and I'm shaping and I'm making the specimens, I'm going to do this big glass, glass enclosure that I'm going to put my specimens in eventually. Um, and one of the things that's really kind of crazy about that, that there are more of the turquoise specimens that you can no longer get than there are materials that I do have. So, I mean, it's at that point in Hubei, these, these specimens I'm showing you are the specimens that will go in that showcase. And this eventually will be, actually this year, will be something that, um, that again, would be one of those turquoises that I'm not able to do any more designs I, I can with. tell you as a host here, every single time you have brought Hubei, it is like wildfire, right? It oh, just well, it smokes. Out. Because but, people are waiting for it. They search Hubei, even when you're not here, Jay, because we really understand the value and the beauty and well, the rarity of and this. The, and the great thing with this is it's really an American story. You know, the Americans, uh, the Ameri um, I, in fact, I still, a, a lot of them are still alive. The original pioneers came from New Mexico, Arizona, Nevada, and Colorado. That's that's where the pioneers of this material came from. Oh, it's so special. We are very busy on the line as we wrap this one up. Just because we move on to the next item, if you're really serious and contemplating this beautiful rare Hubei that is just so desirable, you've got to be in the ordering process now. 695-875 is your item number. $28.33 uh, plus your shipping is all you're going to pay right now to get it home. You don't have to pay that full price up front, but if you're looking for the rarest, the most exciting, the one that has the conversation, because it's all very special. We're all in love with turquoise here. Uh, if you love the idea of that vintage turquoise that, I mean, just can't get it, uh, please place your order. 695-875 is your item number. We are starting the second hour. We're getting close to our second hour. And if maybe that style is not uh, your speed, Take a look at this next Hubei necklace that we've got coming up for you. Very different, a little bit more demure, Jay. Those unique, you know, uh, rare uh, cuts on those, almost like a marquise uh, with those spacers as well. But you see this, this is this is why we love, we swoon over Hubei. Look at how, it, it just look looks like it's all is. different minds. And here again, um, the reason I designed this, I'm designing it around the material. So I have these long flats, these long nuggets 
that I couldn't make the big cylinder beads or I can't, right. I can't you know, so you actually have to look at the material you have left over. And that's, that's part of, it's not only part of the challenge, it's part of the fun, I yeah. think, yeah. is seeing, you know, really kind of envisioning what you can do with that material. And this is something, to be honest with you, that I've never done before in Hubei Turquoise. Mm. A very different look. Uh, a little bit lighter, a little bit softer. Yes. Um, uh, they're Good. also, just so you know, I, I think, I don't know if we're sold out, but there is a pendant. There was a bracelet, and I know one of the earrings sold out. I don't know if both of the earrings sold out mm. on this yet. But in, here again, if you want a, a different look, maybe something a little bit smaller, mm -hmm. and you want the Hubei, but it, look at this. And if Isn't we have pretty? two or three of these and put them all together, you would see that they're all uniquely different in their own right. There's they no two that are, are identical. They are gorgeous. Oh, I love this one. $18.33 gets this one home. Also on sale for that rare Hubei vintage turquoise. 695, 695 is your item number. That was easy. <laughs> um, go ahead and start placing your order now. This is more your style. Uh, and then we are going to kick off with um, a, a brand new look here, right? Or actually, that's the wrong card. Uh, just back in stock, and here's the best part about it. Sometimes we get lucky, right? And Jay is the most transparent when it comes to that. If it's something he knows he can bring back, he will let us know. If it's something that really, last call before that ship sails, he tells us as well. So many of us fell in love with this blue banded opal, and so um, we actually managed to get some more. This is just back in stock. Well, um, this this material, this is kind of, again, not to sound, my mom always says, you know, my mom's my biggest critic, okay? As um, it should be. Okay, and so <laughs> we need I always call her you after guys the show, and, and she tells me uh, how I came off. So, <laughs> good, good <laughs> so mom. You got to love my mom. I love my mom. And, uh, but uh, she always says, you sound like a broken record, right? So I'm sorry about that. But <laughs> I, I will tell you, and I don't want to always, you know, uh, scream, oh, my God, you're never going to be able to get it again. Mm -hmm. But really, um, when we did this, this is not the, this is blue opal, but it's the banded material, yeah, right? And we like also that. did it. I don't want you to confuse this with another blue opal we did where it was an all a solid blue. This is actually the, the banded matrix material um, that, that we did. Uh, we did this one time before. We did this exact uh, same necklace. Mm -hmm. It blew out. People Absolutely. loved it. So many people missed out on it. Uh, they requested, can you bring it back? Um, we had some of the beads that we had in process on the first order that we just didn't have time to finish them. And so we, you know, we, we, we didn't ship the right. first order That's right. in full. So what we did is we took the beads that we had mm -hmm. remaining and then we add, we cut all the material that I had to be able to do this. I still think we delivered a third of what they actually what wanted or requested. <laughs> so this is something, the reason I'm telling you this, this isn't something that you'll see again. Okay, it's a banded blue opal. It's very unique. Oh, it's so um, I would say it's rare to the, to the, into the point of fact is that I've only seen this from this one location in the world. So in 40 plus years of doing this, I've only seen this material one time. I have never seen anything like this uh, other than uh, from this deposit. When, um, when this is gone, it's gone. It's not something I can repeat on. I don't, I doubt that there'll be more of the material knowing um, how they mined this. And um, it was a secondary mining operation that's not, uh, it's no longer uh, functioning. So I, I doubt that you'll ever uh, be able to, I won't. I guess what I'm trying to say is I'm not going to be making any matching yeah. pieces or anything. Yeah. This would have to be a standalone piece. And Jay, that is all natural color. I think that it, is. It's all a natural opal, but it's a banded. It so has, cool. um, I think they're chalcedony and agate bands or quartz bands that is, is what the banding is. And then uh, you've got the silica, you've got the opals. So which makes it a very, very uh, big challenge because the opal is softer mm. than the, the quartz materials and the uh, uh, chalcedony materials. And so... When you, uh, when you cut it, you fast it, and you polish it, mm. it really takes um, somebody who's very, very skillful to be able to do it. And this one is one of those that you see it online and you're and then you see it in person and it's absolutely striking. The blue is, I mean, it's unmistakably blue. Uh, I love that that is all natural color. And then Jay took it even further because each one of those has been hand faceted as well. So hand strung, hand faceted. So it almost glitters, right? It, it, right. it sparkles, You can see it with Val, okay, and she's got this against a, a dark color, but you see, she's just any little movement. Yeah. You see what happens? Yeah. And this is probably the worst light possible mm -hmm. that you could show anything in is stage lighting, just so you know. 
Um, but do you see any little movement? You get that sparkle, you get that sheen, you get that glow. It kind of has a, a, a like life pretty. to it. Really, yeah. really unique material. Yeah, this is one of them too that against the skin is absolutely gorgeous. I still remember when you did the Today Special and we were all blown away. <laughs> that was um, a that was a different material. Th right, but it was a blue opal but it was as a blue well. Opal. That and that's why I say I don't want people to confuse. Yeah, the two. Uh, this one is also from. Where is this one from, Jay? Uh, is this, this from India as well? Out this out of, it comes out of India. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and and by the way, you made it a customer pick at 160 today. It's on sale. If you want to bring it home, all of our jewelry, as we celebrate jewelry this week at HSN, is on Six Flex, which means any major debit card or credit card, you can break your jewelry purchases down into six monthly payments. Those are all interest free. We take all the major credit cards. Twenty-one dollars gets us home. I think if you're a, a, you know, a Navy girl, I've been having a Navy moment. I talked to everybody about it. Uh, I, if you, if you love your denims, your jean jackets, but also what you said because of that faceting because of that little bit of a sparkle you know even your little black dress a plain little dress or a white button down blouse you know collar popped up it is magnificent because it is genuinely blue you will see the blue it's not is it blue? Is it gray? Is it, you know, it's just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, we're going to move on to this next item. This is brand new Mind Find as well. Um, actually, no, this one is not. I, I thought this was the other one. I'm this wrong. is Brichiated Calcidney. But first time on this markdown. Right. Look at these gorgeous, beautiful, soft tones that are just pure romance. Uh, your necklace is 18 inches in the length, two and three quarter inch extender. We also have that Th uh, that three drop earring uh, included in there. So that's $38.60. They are both on sale. Prettiest look when you think, especially these are natural colors, well, and right? You, you know, the thing That's with, the way they come from the earth. The thing with cal calcities, right? You find them not, you know, I, well, I guess you do find them on it pretty much every continent. Uh, I've gotten different calcities uh, in my entire career. Um, I find them fascinating. In the fact they're like agates, and they're also like um, uh, uh, agates are like sapphires. They come in every multitude of color, every color imaginable under the rainbow. This is a unique material in the fact that it's brecciated. Mm -hmm. So what is brecciated? Brecciated is what what has happened. If you can imagine this, can you see like the the matrix in the lines? Yep, right there. Mm -hmm. That's actually. Um, what, what's happened is, can you imagine there was like an earthquake, right? Mm -hmm. And it cracked this. Right. So it's all jumbled up and cracked. Right. Over millions one. and millions and millions of years, where those cracks were, do you see where there's yep. like spaces and stuff? Mm -hmm. That filled in with other gemmy material mm -hmm. and it filled in with other cal... And it, the, the chalcedony is formed in this way. Um, it's what leached through. So all the minerals and elements that were in this soil and that went into solution that filled in those Look cracks. At that. Look at this one. So it filled in the cracks. Uh, you can see where the whites are. Isn't that pretty? And it filled in those cracks Look and then that. it solidified. And then over millions of years, time and pressure, it, it, it uh, solidified and became hard. And so that's why you have uh, calcidney uh, that's appreciated, but you have calcidney and then you also have different. Uh, uh, different minerals and elements. So also it's like they've all that. been pressure, like through heat and pressure, and it's they just what they call melt. metamorphosize. It's metamorphic rock. It's a uh, time, heat, pressure. So beautiful, and then you get to have these color: the blushes, the pinks, the salmon. I mean, it's just beautiful and romantic. And look how pretty it is against the skin. Don't forget the matching earrings are really easy and lightweight. Those have also been faceted. They also graduate in size. You get the smaller bead up on top to the biggest, uh, most rounded of the beads on the bottom there but just a wonderful opportunity today we're seeing all of these wonderful pastel colors you know all these shades of rose and uh, taupes coming into play in fashion and as we head into spring certainly one you want to consider remember the six flex means you could probably get these two together because I'd like to try to get the set Jay because your pieces are so rare that when I come to try to match things back I'm like now what do I do? Why didn't I do that? So if you can't do it, you can't do it. Right. But if you can... But, but I always tell people, you know, set a budget, set. watch a budget. But one of the things that they do here is that they, may, you know, with the flex pay, uh, it makes it very, very affordable. But here again, a set a budget, keep it. But I will say this, okay, that if you think about it, this material, you're not going to go anywhere else and find this That's anywhere. Right. So the good thing is, I mean, a lot of things will go back to this. So if you mm -hmm. don't get the earrings, it's not, you yep. know, it's not like you're not going to find something that'll match back to it. But if you have the earrings 
cut from the same material rough, yep. you're, you've, got, you've got a match. You know, yeah, it's even because it came from the same original harvest. I mean, if you wanted to, you could even do a little pearl stud. It doesn't matter, but at the end of the day, the you know, earrings are so sweet, too. Yeah, but you can wear, there's all, I could name all kinds of different things. Even yep. orange corals would mm. go with this. There's a lot of things that we make that would go with this. We've got kunzai coming up, too, with those pinks in there as well, if, if you're loving the pinkiness. That pinkiness. would actually, yeah, well, that's right? kind of a neutral. Yeah. yeah. So take a look here at how this goes with your winter luscious colors, your deeper, rich jewel tones. But in the spring and summer, you want to wear this with a beautiful, maybe white button-down black or a white blazer and maybe a little, you know, pair of palazzo pants. I mean, look at how gorgeous these colors are. They are soft. They are beautiful. They are very flattering. Um, remember, 18 inches in the length on that necklace, two and three quarter inch extender. The earrings come in at almost two inches in that length. All sterling silver jewelry, so 0.925, all handcrafted. It is a delight uh, to be able to wear J. King jewelry. And by the way, we didn't even ask for phone calls, so if any of of you are J King girls you, you absolutely love you tune into the shows even when you're not shopping because I know I do if I'm home and you're on I am watching I'm paying attention